Okay, I'm in the lobby of the Merlot. All right, let's do it. I'm hacking in. Look at that. Secrets and lies floating in a cloud of data. I just reach out, pluck it from the sky, and it's mine. It's ours. Stay focused. We got a nasty security system. How much we got? A hundred grand in 30 seconds. God bless the rich and famous. We are the modern day magicians. Siphoning bank accounts out of thin air. Do you hear yourself? <laughs> I think someone else is hacking in. Let's take a peek. Let's not. Stick to the plan, Damien. Siphon the accounts and get out. Adventure, my boy. Have faith in your mentor. Something triggered that alarm. Let's find it. Shit. It's the system. I'm almost there. I'm shutting down now. Don't you touch a thing. What the hell is that? We need to abort. We are not done. Help me! Damien, it's over. I'm disconnecting. Maurice. Yeah? You're on. One of our contractors ran a search for the hackers in the Merlot job. You're assigned Aiden Pierce. Take him out. Hit the family if you need to. This guy's hacking days are done. Hit the family? Got a problem? Nope. I'll scare him good. You'll never hear from him again. Gave the order. <laughs> I told you. I don't know. You don't know. Ain't the family? Not a problem. Nope. I'll scare him good. You'll never hear from him again. So what do you think, Maurice? Did you scare me? It was a job, man. I didn't know. Who was on the other end of the call? Give me a name. They never gave me a name. Yeah, and I'll tell your name. Go. Oh. Lena. Lena Pierce. I didn't know about any kids, all right? That wasn't supposed to happen. I want you to think very carefully. Think. Look, man. Even if I knew a name, you couldn't get me talking. These guys... I heard stories, man, are like nothing you ever seen before. You gotta walk away from this, man. Some things you can't walk please, away from. Please! Who gave the order? I spoke to them on the phone and they told me where to find you. That's all I know, man. That's all I know. Give me a name. I don't know! A name! Kill me, man. Just fucking kill me.
How's your memory now? Yo, Maurice! Yo, it's shaking, motherfucker. Shit! Where the hell you been? What? He's talking to me. I leave you for two minutes. Give me my bullets. I tossed them. But you said you'd kill them otherwise. I told you to hold on to them, Jordy. Where you been, anyway? I had to make a call. And you get what you need from Maurice? Ah, oh, you're kidding me. Let's clean this mess up. Stop admiring your work. Hey, that's cute and all, but I'm disappointed, Pierce. I mean, you failed to spot the nasty inter-gang drama I'm creating here. I don't like loose ends. Let's get him out of here. No, too late. Bottom of the eighth. Chicago's ahead. Game's almost over. We are out of time. <laughs> huh. Nice shot. Come on, you're not just a little interested in my phone call. All right, fine. Tell me about your phone call. Glad you asked. Okay, we got a bunch of dead bodies, right? We got 40,000 people above us. We need a distraction. I called the cops. You did? Oh, yeah, true story. So, cops arrive, and Maurice's little band of brothers arrive, and pow, 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 pow. Jordy, tell me you're joking. No, no, I called them too. Look, we get a messy altercation at the end of the game. You and I slip away undetected. He'll appreciate the plan tomorrow. Great. Punctual cops. I'm gonna handle these guys. You grab Maurice, get him out of here. Maurice? What do I look like, a chauffeur? He's the shooter. I'm not through with him yet. Hey. Ugh. Dick. Chicago police! If there's anybody in here, identify yourselves.
opposed now by Jorge Sanova, who ended with an outstanding 15-7 record last season. We're watching an epic confrontation between two old rivals here today, and this game couldn't be any closer. Big base deal is on this team with 27 steals this series, but Sanova's like watching them like on the other side. That's a pitch and a hit, and it looks like... Yeah, that's a foul ball. Rogers not falling for that one. Both men, of course, experts at the mind game. Two on, two out, folks. Something's gonna give soon, and it could go either way. Sonoma pitches. That's a big hit! See anything? Nope. Quiet here. We've got a known vice boy in the VIP lounge. We're gonna check him out. Okay, I'm coming up. Slow down, this. He's not moving unless I give him a reason. Keep your hands where I can hey, see them. this is bullshit, Jay didn't do nothing wrong. Get back now. You're viceroys, aren't you? That ain't illegal, right? Don't get smart. How did you two afford VIP ticket? Mm, bet she makes more than you do. Yeah? Hey, yo, what? Didi, calm down, all right? Don't give them nothing they can use. Something tells me if we run you shit stains through the system, we'll come up with plenty we can use. I need to see ID. Both of you. Well, I ain't showing shit. Oh, shit. Hey, y'all filming this? I want to see this motherfucker online. Fine. I don't need ID. I'd ask you to smile, but it works better if you don't. Hey, man. I did not give you permission to take my picture. Here we go. Jerome Richards. Looks like we got a trafficking warrant out on you. That we can definitely use. Man, this is messed up. We got right? Just keep quiet a minute. You do have that right. Fuck you. are about to lock this whole place down. I'm stuck unless we create a major distraction. I want to cut the power and slip past them. To the whole stadium? I thought you wanted to keep the vigilante out of the news. Everything's connected to the CTOS with a serious firewall. Right now, I need to get out of the stadium. Can you find me the nearest access point? In the next room. Well, you'll need to find someone with security clearance. Security guard should have access. With all these cops, there's gotta be one around. Evacuation plan, right? Of course we do. Good, we need to get moving on it. We're not gonna evacuate 40,000 people so we can play cowboys and Indians. But you got an isolated incident in the That's basement, good. we can close the basement. I got no problem with that. This whole place is about to fill up with Chicago PD. That's gonna cause a panic. We need to shut the game down and get people out of here safely. Oh, shut it down, eh? I can't make that call. Well, then call somebody who can make that call, please. Okay, hang on. Yeah, give me Barry.
Where are you, Jordy? What? Gone. I'm allergic to cops, so is my race. But don't worry, I left you a present. Friend of a friend deals in pre-owned cars. Got a real beauty waiting for you in the garage across the street. Take it or leave it, and I don't care. Gotta go. Maybe they okay, fuck with places.
these guys. I heard stories, man, that like nothing I've ever seen before. You gotta walk away from this, man. Why are you sitting here? He's coming, right? Not like last time. Jackson, I did invite him. It's been so long. Are you sure you called the right number? Honey, your uncle's a different kind of person. It doesn't mean he doesn't love us. Our info in finding Maurice was correct. We've gained access to the CTUS back door while the police were being distracted by you. Since we both went in this, we'll share what we have. That back door allows you some access to the CTUS network. I've been working on something bigger. Give me time. Sick of remembering her that way. It's 
Just ever dream of her tiny face pressing the window when she knows I was coming over? Or that little wobbly dance she did? It's always the same nightmare. For me, this city's full of distractions, and they can't hide from me. I'll have to thank CTOS one day. Simple breach of their facial recognition software and I've got access to everyone's personal details. of his call and he's mine. somewhere. Just move carefully. Don't get spotted. Let the profiler do the work. Talk. There is nothing to talk about. We're done. Deal with You're it. You're so fucking wrong. I'm not done yet. Get gotta away! Stop him now. I'll scream. Oh, I'll teach you. Oh. Not your business. You saved me. Thank you.
Vicky, hey, I know, I know, the party started. It's almost over. Where are you? I'm on my way. Ugh, you make me crazy. Jackson's really looking forward to it. Get over here. We miss you. I miss you too. I'll be there. Sorry, Nick, I need to take this off. I'll see you soon. Good. You got out. Look, if you need some wheels, give me a call. I'll, I'll set you up. Pre-owned cars? You'd rather register yourself at a car dealer? I don't ask questions. This guy gets me any ride I want. And you, if you need it. I just might. How's Maurice doing? Oh, he's all sunshine and buttercups. I'm gonna dump him at my little dumping place. I need him alive, Jordy. Yeah, yeah, alive. Whatever. Goes against your better nature, huh? I'd pop him and be done, but hey, you pay me right, I'll keep him alive as long as you want. I do work for a paycheck. I haven't been in Nikki since the funeral. Am I ready? Jack's last birthday, Lena sang off key. Happy birthday. Full throttle, no holes barred. Now, I'm afraid of the silence. Okay. Here goes. How old are you today? Ten. No, I think you're nine. I'm ten. Nine. Ten. Nine. <laughs> ten. Well, in that case, uh, you deserve ten birthday tickles. What? One, two, three, four, <laughs> oh. five, six, oh. seven, eight, oh. nine, ten. <laughs> ten. 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 Stay here for a second. So, an entire year and... A... Yeah, late. Yeah, I'm sorry, Nate. Really. Come here. Let's have a look at you. You look older. Oh, nice. <laughs> Thanks for that. <laughs> it's his first birthday without Lena. Uh, how's he doing? Still doesn't talk to anybody but me. Yolanda says it's his way of maintaining some sort of control. Yolanda? His therapist. She's helping him. It's good. Just slow. It's hard, but we're gonna get through it. Mm -hmm. Jax. Hey. Sorry I'm late. Can I, uh, do I get a hug? Wow. You are big. <laughs> so, hey, what, what do you got there? Wow, the healer. Cool. You bought him a real toy, huh? <laughs> Why don't you bring up your toys? I'm gonna speak with your uncle. Yeah, I'll be, I'll be up there in a sec. This matters. You being here. I just need to make sure that things are different. Things are different. You 
and Jax are the most important people in my life. I'm not going to stop watching out for you. <laughs> Always the big brother, huh? Last time I was back here, it was Lena's birthday. Jackson adored her. We all did. You missed all the fun. The kids were playing vigilante, imitating that guy they keep talking about on TV. Let me guess. Jax was the vigilante. No, they were all the vigilantes, and I was the only villain, but I make a mean bad guy. <laughs> I gave him hell. I should have come earlier. I could have warned them. Don't mess with my sister. Remember when you and Mom were both sick as dogs, but Dad insisted his boy was going to have his birthday cake? That thing was an abomination. All burnt and lopsided. That was Dad in a nutshell. He did a lot of ugly things, but it was always about family. <laughs> Listen to me, I'm rambling. Listen, the police can trace this call. I know where you live. How are the locks on those doors? Who is this? Why are you calling? Do you feel safe, Nikki? Who was that? Doesn't matter, just some stupid crank, it happens. Do you think this is strong enough? Look, did you know his voice? Oh, Jesus, Aiden, just leave it, it's fine. It's fine, he thinks he can get inside. How do you know what he thinks? You're checking the locks. Look, I can handle this on my own, we do not need your help. Nikki, I can find this guy. Hey, look, Aiden, God, you have not changed at all. We do not need your help. Please stop trying to fix our problems. Every time you try, you just make things worse. Better go. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. Right. Grown man making crank calls. Let's see how safe you feel when I trace your call. There you are. Damn it! He's on the move! Sorry, I overreacted. You just make me so crazy sometimes. Uh-huh. Come on back, okay? I promise I won't freak out on you. Uh... Aiden? You're going after that creep, aren't you? Well... You're doing it right now. I can't believe you. It's not like that. Stop being a hero, Aiden. Let it go. Let what? Yeah, the call's breaking up. I can't hear you. No, you can hear me perfectly. You need to stop right now. Yeah, hello? You still there? Can't hear you. Okay, gotta go. Oh! So we have a deal? Shit, yeah, I can't believe you're paying me that much just to make a crank call. Nikki Pierce, right? I'll mention the locks like you said. And her kid. I, I, this feels wrong. That's the point. 
Someone paid this asshole to harass Nikki. Who would pay for something like that? Did you get anywhere with DedSec? Any of those CTOS hacks? Yeah, I'm still trying. They're kicking you out. Give me time. Okay, well, I need your help then. Can you trace a phone call? How can I refuse my best client? Wait, what am I looking at here? It's from a guy who threatened my family. I want to know who hired him. Well, the call came from somewhere in the Loop District. But that's as far as I can see. Okay. If I can hack CTOS inside the Loop... Then I should be able to pinpoint the source of that call. Let's do that. Bloom's building a new CTOS center in the Loop. It's perfect. DedSec tried to attack that center last month. We failed, and they just added more armed guards. So it won't be easy. Be careful. You sound like my sister. Relax. Make sure I'm armed and dangerous. Bloom hires private contractors to guard their CTOS centers. These guys will be geared up and wired for action. But I'll be ready. a full year of CTOS operation or the Chicago Smart City program and the feedback from the public has been largely positive. We're on the street to hear what some of you have to say. It's cool. I can pay my transit with my phone and I always know if the L is on time. So, yeah. Um, I, I like, um, that it tracks where I am and tells me in real time if the traffic is jammed or whatever. Even tells me, you know, where there's available parking. Compares prices, gotta save some cash, right? I don't notice that much. Still watching though, right? I don't want nobody knowing where I'm at all the time. I got my kids daycare and doctors on it, and uh, it uh, we, we let's my wife and I uh, you know, both check in and see schedules, you know, and uh, it, well, yeah, 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 it's good. Yeah. yeah. City insiders say the CTOS is working smoothly and has already netted millions of dollars in savings. Mayor Donovan Rushmore called Chicago the envy of all American cities. 